All right, I'm gonna do a jack change. I got this smaller one here. It's all bent out of order, and it's lifted its fair share of loads, just worn out. So the plan is to upgrade to this larger one, 12,000 pound jack. I got this drop down the spring, so I don't have to keep a piece of wood around it, so that should be convenient. The goal is to take this piece of channel here and put it up and then I'll have top and bottom to mount to so this doesn't twist and turn like the old one did. Uh, hard part is going to be cutting this notch here to fit the angle here of this tongue and then getting it all lined up and welding it with this uh, box in the way and on this side of here you got the tongue so should be a pretty easy project. Uh, I gotta decide how I want this to sit exactly. I'm thinking it's gonna sit like that and then uh, and probably have my C channel on the back side here backed up to against it and then the uh, two channels will be sitting backwards towards the back of the trailer. So we will uh, first start by cutting out the old one. It's on this piece of C channel. And it looks like it's only welded on the top, so my plan is to get the uh, plasma cutter or maybe the torch and just torch that weld out of there. And hopefully this whole uh, system will just drop out and I can put in the new one and be good to go. So that's the plan, let's get after it. fit in there like so let's get it parallel and then uh jack will mount right where my thumb is there should be good to go so i gotta clean this up grinder clean the frame up with the grinder set my height on the jack clean up the jack and then weld everything together and it should be done it should be easy Gonna change over to my uh, grinding blade. It's a little thicker than a cutoff wheel. It's what I was using just now. This is pretty thin. It's making my notches with. So switch that out. Thank you. 
Okay, so my plan with this is I'm gonna weld this to this first, and then I'll weld the jack on. That way I don't have to worry about this moving with the heavy jack. And uh, this this will be easy to weld these two sides of the jack here and this front while it's in place. Otherwise, it would be harder to maneuver those two items, the jack and the brace together.